The European Commission has set its sights on making Europe a leading location for quantum computing. Quantum computers provide an answer to one of the main challenges in computing, the physical limits of conventional computing power. Regular computers use bits as their smallest unit of information. But whereas bits can only take the values of either 0 or 1, the so-called quantum bits, qubits, of the quantum computer can take both values simultaneously. This is known as superposition and it allows for faster parallel operations exponentially increasing computing power. The European Union will invest 1 billion euros in quantum computer development over the next 10 years. The German government will also contribute around 650 million euros for research and development in quantum technologies during this period. At the Forschungszentrum Jülich, scientists are currently working on a 100 qubit computer scheduled to go into operation by the end of 2021. In September 2018, scientists in Jülich put Joules into operation. At that time, it was the fastest supercomputer in Germany, with a power equivalent to 60,000 conventional computers. In the meantime, scientists at the Leibniz Supercomputing Center in Munich have developed a supercomputer that is even faster than Joules, the so-called Super MUCNG, which is currently going operational, has a computing power of 26.9 petaflops. Here's how to imagine what 26.9 petaflops mean. If everyone on Earth, approximately 8 billion people, tried to calculate what the Super MUCNG is able to in a single second, it would take them 6,725,000 years. Mind-boggling, isn't it? The supercomputer will be used for all areas of science. It will also be available for commercial usage, provided companies agree to a scientific cooperation. With competitive research facilities like these and a vast network of industrial partners, Germany is playing a key role in developing the computers of the future.